Hey, what's up, all you guys? Surreal Canine here with some more uh, Explores of Sky. Last time, we got introduced to Sandy, Cindy, and Mindy of Team Charm. It's, uh, it's gonna be quite the adventure, isn't it? <laughs> Let's go. So, in the last ep we, in the last episode, we also crossed the southern jungle and met up with Ismelda, who is uh, not yet a guildmaster, it seems like. Is everyone over there an explorer? Probably. Everyone's gathered, aiming for a treasure at the depths of the quarry. Wow, pretty ladies. Oh, are you ladies in the exploration team too? You look way too delicate to be an exploration team. This is too difficult for you girls, you should get up. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, but it's not good to judge others by their appearance. So cool. Whoa. By the way, what's the status of the treasure? Oh, no one's found it yet. Unfortunately, nothing's been found. Nothing at all. Set in this quarry is a really complex labyrinth. It's really easy to get lost in. Even so, you should be able to get at least halfway through. But after the waypoint, it's really difficult. Difficult? It, yeah, if you try to move forward, you always end up right back where you started. No matter how many times you try. And so almost everyone's been coming back here to discuss it. There's gotta be some kind of puzzle to it somehow, they think. If you don't figure out the puzzle, you'll never find the treasure. But Lawson was saying the same thing earlier. It seems like this treasure is a really difficult one to find. It seems that way. But if it's that kind of treasure, there's value in finding it. We're Team Charm. Nothing's impossible. So cool. Hey, you, over there. You, give up now. This treasure's ours. It's these three again. This treasure is going to be found by none other than the Band of Thieves. Team AWD. Team AWD? Band of Thieves with the bad reputation. Team AWD is here. Got it? You, if you don't want to get hurt, I suggest you get out of here as fast as you can. Hey, what's with them? You, you don't know about Team AWD? Team AWD is a band of thieves whose wickedness knows no bounds. Pretty sure that's Drapion over there. He can beat down any opponent with the claws on both his arms and his long fangs. That's Arbok, he's incredibly vindictive. There in the center is the boss, Weavile. Rumor says she's really strong. Says that she pursues her goal by any means, fair or foul. Team AWD is known everywhere for its terrible behavior. It's said that each and every Pokemon that's run into them in a dungeon, they all come away from that encounter stripped of all their possessions. Hey, you guys. Weren't you listening? Didn't my lady Weavile tell you to hit the road? If you don't scram, it's going to be pretty painful for you. Better listen up. I've been getting restless because it's been too long since I asked somebody to beat someone down. So, the first one to get stepped on. You don't even have feet! Who's it gonna be? Everyone, what's wrong? I. I give up. Me too! Cowards. Say, Drapion. Are those cute girls still here? Yeah, yeah, they are. Shocker. These girls seem to have some spine. Aren't you scared of us? Oh, I see. You admire us and want to become friends. <laughs> that's it, that's it. If that's how it is, it's real simple. You girls are cute, so I guess I'll let you be friends with us. <laughs> Just who do you think you are? What? Become friends with Pokemon who have terrible reputations such as yourselves? Why would we want to do a thing like that? What? We don't think you're scary or anything. We definitely don't admire you. You! We are so nice to you, and now it seems to have gone to your heads. Huh? You're weaker than I thought. What? Blast. 
Drapion, let's take care of this for real. Wait. Hold it, you. Boss? My Lady Weavile. You. You've made an enemy of Team AWD. And you won't regret it, will you? <laughs> Not at all. His words. We don't forget them. Arbok, Drapion, let's go. You remember this. Next time we meet, we'll finish this. <laughs> you think you can just walk away like that? We've always gotten every treasure so far, so we won't miss it this time either. We won't lose. <laughs> Sandy, Cindy, let's hurry. It. Excuse me. You're earlier. You did you run away? Yes, that's right. Uh, I should have said this sooner. My name is Sentry. Uh, the truth is, I was watching you and Team AWD from the shadows over there. That argument going back and forth. I've never seen anyone stand up to Team AWD like that without flinching. It was amazing. After watching you, I feel like I can trust you, so I have a request. A request? Yeah. Team AWD. Team AWD needs to be punished. Why Team AWD? The truth is, I used to be in an exploration team with some friends a while ago. My friends were attacked by a Team AWD during an adventure. They were hurt very badly. What? And since then, my friends have been too scared to go out exploring again. They spend their days shaking in fear, and so going out exploring with me is completely out of the question for them. That's terrible! You know, they're real scoundrels, just like the rumors say! Do something so terrible that your friends don't want to explore anymore. As explorers, we just can't forgive those bullies. We understand, Sentry. If we run into Team AWD again, we'll definitely punish them. In honor of your friends. Thank you so much. All right, we should really end. We should really end. Get moving. <laughs> that was uh, that was my dirt, not theirs. Into the quarry. Oh hey, it's Mount Steel. All right, here we go. No need to check storage. We're good. Boulder Quarry has 10 floors and then a boss. It's got a lot of ground and electro types as well as these guys. So we've seen the we've seen Aurons and Lairons before, I'm pretty sure. Ooh, Totter Seed, that'll come in handy. Person ban to prevent confusion. Star Raptor, the final form of Starly. Normal flying type, but uh, very high physical attack. Whoop! Good thing I wasn't holding anything. for those, I'm sure. <clears throat> Alright, where we go? Over here, I guess. I think there's a... It's Ampharos! And the lost, are we, Ampharos? Well, that's all well and good. Kapow. It's Ampharos and his brother Ampharos. What else are we going to do? <laughs> You're just being so weird today. Maybe it's because I'm in a really good mood because I've actually had time to record. 
It's one of those uh, couple of no homework days, you know? <sighs> I don't know if I've told anybody this, but I only ever record on weekends, usually Saturday mornings. But, uh, and I've got classes this fall, so it's, sometimes I just have homework. And it's too late for me to really do much of anything. Not today, though. And, you know, sure, Mr. Shogun. Shogun is a pure dragon tut, the evolved form of Bagon. And that is Ninjask. Uh, the evolved form in Kata. Bug flying, I think. Manetric. Pure electric type. The big old doggo. Arcanine's better. I love me some Arcanine. Whoa, check it out. We got two items. Heck yeah. Alright, after this floor, there should be a checkpoint. Yep. The music doesn't even change, what the heck? Let's proceed with caution. Let's not save at all! <laughs> we got this, guys. Let's go! It's a uh, probe pass. What? The move failed! Oh, but did I run out of... No, that can't be right. Oh, you know what? That's because gravity. Yeah, I can't jump because gravity. That makes sense, actually. Still annoying. Yeah, take that, Mr. Guy. We're going on down this way. And up the stairs. Or down the stairs, actually. But who's counting? I sure ain't. I'm just some crazy kind of guy. Uh, that looks like a Tangrowth, which is a uh, pure grass type. Evolved form of Tangela, introduced in the fourth generation. We just kind of skip the floor casually. No big deal. I gotta say, uh, compared to the jungle, this dungeon is not particularly impressive yet. And we've hit the final floor already. Metang, the evolved form of Beldum, a metal psychic type, I believe. By which I mean steel psychic type. Okay, here's the boss floor. Something about this place seems different somehow. So far, the path has been pretty straight without ever diverging. Maybe we got lost without realizing it. Oh no, don't tell me we're lost. What do we do? We should just try to keep moving forward, right? Before we enter, this other exploration team has told us about this. This is probably the complex labyrinth. So rather than getting worried about being lost, think that this is a place where everyone gets lost, so it's only natural that you'll get lost. Wouldn't that help you relax? Not really. Wait, you! Where do you come from? This is my... How could you not know that this is Agron's territory? Really? We didn't know. <laughs> you didn't know. If you didn't know, then allow me to teach you what happens to those who trespass here. Go on out, Laron! Oh no, it's a Pokemon Pokemon trainer. Yeah, yeah, laugh it up, Mr. Agron. 
You realize how weak you guys are to fighting type moves. And we have no choice. We'll be your opponents. <laughs> you ladies are considerably cheerful. However, that composure, how long can you keep it up? Let's go, Laron! Get him! Sandy, Cindy, here they come. Uh, that's that's a twofer. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Uh, here, go get confused. Alright, we kind of got to uh, focus these guys down. Ooh. Actually, yeah, uh, getting surrounded by six, uh, this many of them is uh, kind of a bad idea. Is there anything we could use to turn the tide in our favor? Not really. Not really. Okay, Mindy took one of them out. Okay, that's our first Reviver Seed down. Alright, uh... Okay, I'm gonna have to use my, uh, I'm gonna have to use an orb bear here. Otherwise, I'm just extremely dead. Okay, there goes one of them. Laron shielded his buddy! It didn't help. Accuracy down. This is bad. Okay, that's a crit. Nice work. Good. Oh no! Oh, game over. Okay, wow. Uh, that was something. Okay, we just kind of got owned. Yeah, no kidding. Unfortunately, I don't think there's very much we can do. Look at all these apples. I don't think there's really much we can do in this situation other than just uh, stockpile healing items. We're just gonna have to, we're just gonna have to go and hope things go better this time. Okay, <laughs> good job there, uh, Cindy. Oh, jeez. This is bad. Ah, dang it. Cindy got one shot.
Okay, Mindy leveled up. Ooh, high jump kick. Yes, please. Cindy leveled up. She did not learn anything new though, which is uh, a little sad. Hey, we got high jump kick on Mindy. That's pretty good. Okay, Sandy leveled up. Agility! Could be pretty good. Oh! Oh! That's why I have Baton Pass. Uh... Alright, uh, switch out Mirko. Okay, when we get to the boss, I'm gonna try uh, using Baton Pass to scramble the enemy. <laughs> text uh, folks are probably not going to see. But do you think we just stumbled back in here without thinking? Last time didn't go so well. Don't you think we'd be claiming something this time? This time we won't lose. Hmm. As usual, you're only good at talking. It's fine. How many times are you going to come here? Just looking for a fight. Let's go, Laron! Get him! Okay, let's set up everyone else's moves. Uh... There we go. Alright. There we go. Let's get crazy! This might have been a bad idea. Oh jeez, yeah. Yeah, this might have been a bad idea. Oh, well, high jump kick is uh, about as effective as usual. I 
I gonna heal myself this time? This is not going very well, though. Oh, jeez. Uh, yep, okay, we lost again. Yeah, excuse me while I... Excuse me while I attempt this a couple of times. down. This is now level 33. Followed shortly thereafter by a level up on Cindy. Not very much in the way of stats though, that's for sure. And now, level up on Sandy. Let's see, HP, attack, de Ooh, that's a good bit of defense. Yeah, okay, I like that. Okay, so if you go down from the checkpoint, you can go back to the entrance of Boulder Quarry. Might be good to run through the first fly five floors for a while and uh, just farm up Oran Berries or Reviver Seeds or something. Plenty of reviver seeds, so uh, sorry, Team Olympia. <laughs> you might just have to do this. Okay, trying this again. I was lucky enough to pick up yet another reviver seed on the way down as well, so I've got seven extra lives this time uh, to share between the whole party, granted, but. Uh, Alright, so I think I'm going to have uh, Cindy stick with using Growl, because her psychic attacks are not especially useful compared to uh, the fighting type moves on the other two guys. Alright, let's see what we can do. Just use a whole bunch of growls to re reduce everyone's attack. That's the best thing Cindy can do for us right now. Yeah! 600 damage! Nice one there, uh, Mindy. Alright, we've got Reviver Seeds. I'd rather use those than Oran Berries. Oran Berries are slow. We need to get as many of these guys out, out of the room as possible. Even if it means we've got, we're each surrounded by like three guys for a zillion turns each. Yeah, how well did that work for you, Mr. Guy, huh? Okay, it's down to three against three. Okay, I think we actually got this now. I think we got this now.
No baton pass needed. <laughs> Run. Run! <laughs> he panicked and ran off. We're Team Charm. Don't underestimate us. Well, at least we won't be held back anymore. Let's keep moving. So it almost seems like the scenery has changed slightly from before. Huh? Here, there's two entrances? Looks like the labyrinth continues. We'll probably have to choose the correct entrance to proceed. Yeah, but which one should we choose? Just looking at them, they seem to be the same. I think it's fine. Pick whichever one you like. Yeah, no sense in worrying about it. For now, go ahead and pick an entrance and we'll find out if it's the right one. That's gonna happen next time. <laughs> that took entirely too long. <laughs>